you guys have any like YouTube accounts you wanna give a shout out to or whatever, and I'll give an annotation for it. All right. Uh, he did Soul 2010. Subscribe to me. And uh, you don't have one. He doesn't I have one, one yet. He'll be making. One. Uh, Dark Arms Four game with the four. Uh, yeah. No There's e no arm. E. There's no E. At GT4619. I am DJ Deathstar 4. DJ Deathstar. Deathstar 4? Yeah. Okay, there'll be an annotation somewhere here. Right now, and yeah, I'm supposed to do uh, Pokemon Wi Fi battles, and I'm going to start. Oh, doing, really? Yeah, Pokemon Wi Fi battles, and I'm going to start doing this now. <laughs> Alright, cool. So you guys go check them out. Alright. Thanks a lot. No What deck type do you think is going to take the event today? Frog. Frog, Frog FDK. FDK for sure. If, like, if people play Frog FDK, I think that's going to win. But I think Black Wings can also win. Yeah. I'm not sure. Just because with the new format that we're getting next month. Right. But the way that I've seen the decks nowadays is most likely either going to be a weird build of Black Wings, maybe X Sabers. But I've been seeing a lot of people trying to build Fables. But like I've been telling everybody in my area. Fables right now are not that good until we get the next couple hit Arsenal sets. So, if I would have to say, I would have to say uh, X Sabers might take it. Um, well, it's hard to say because there's a lot of um, exclusives that are getting taken out of worlds. There's uh, there's no Dark Souls, there's no Launchers, there's no Ronin Toten. So, I, I really don't even know everything that's going on. I just know that there's no Frog OTK for any of these events. So it's probably be Black Wings, a lot of uh, Gladiator Beasts. I think those are the cards that are pretty much consistent between the two, uh, the two well, all the countries. Yeah. Exactly. exactly what you just said. Gladiator <laughs> Beasts and Black Wings. Because of the TCG exclusives and the OCG exclusives can't be played. Right. There. So it cuts out a lot of decks. So we'll probably see some surprise decks. Nice. <laughs> The new uh, pineapple, what's it, what's it called? Nature, Nature pineapple. pineapple. Do you think it's worth the hype or do you think it's overrated? I think it's worth it. I, I think, think it is worth totally it. Worth yeah. it. The card is a free tree one frog for a broken ass archetype. Tribute for something that cannot be like that like you can't activate. Spell. You cannot. You cannot activate spells. And then with oppression. And then if you play spell. oppression, then like mm -hmm. bamboo shoot. And then it's like, you have, what do you do to get out? Like you can't get out of that. Pineapple. Tribute for bamboo shoot. Activate oppression. You're like look, so many decks have no outs to them. Bamboo shoot. Like, Glad. <laughs> and it looks no outs. No yeah. outs. No yeah. outs. <laughs> looks I think pineapple totally. Yeah. Okay. I don't know, cause I mean, I believe it. It's, I can't really say just because I don't really see anything good with Naturas. They seem to be more of an, an, like one of those archetypes that focuses around every card you play. Because there are some where you activate a spell, you search your deck for another one, you activate a trap, you gain life points. It's basically, um, it's more of an archetype for if you're barely starting the game. But Natura Pineapple, I see potential if I, if I can see it in action. But until I see a natural pineapple in a deck and actually being used in a game, I'll, that's when I can say, like, oh, this card's broken. But right now, I think it's it's in between one of the two options right now. Well, it's, um, yeah, it's, it's definitely overhyped, just like mm -hmm. <laughs> most stuff that comes out. I mean, yeah, like, the bamboo should have a good effect, but then, and then pineapple's okay, but they don't have enough support yet, you know, maybe later down the line. What do you think? The car is horribly overpriced, so you should just wait until the next set comes out, until, like what he said, more support comes out before you try to make the new archetype decks. I see. Okay. What do you think Konami needs to do to take Yu-Gi-Oh! to the next level of prestige? Stop um, reprinting all the cards. <laughs> so yeah, like reprinting everything. And, and upgrade like, the prizes, maybe. Like, like, yeah. like the PS3, Wii, that kind of thing. <laughs> well, yeah, that's definitely kind of Give away stuff like that. Like, yeah. Give away TVs, give away like, <laughs> sound systems, give stuff like that. Yeah. Um, yeah, they definitely need to stop reprinting and a lot of the stuff. Yeah, they need to stop reprinting all of this stuff. Yeah. Like, okay. so many cards with so much value. Like, yeah. Just I guess continue what they're doing, because ever since they took over the game, they've been doing well. I mean, Upper Deck, yeah, they had all the... Um, yeah, they, they had previews in tournaments at conventions, but I'm starting to like the whole um, sneak previews at, at stores because now it, it has more of a, like it gives more of a challenge for those to see like, oh, we have to get there early, get the good cards. Or, but for Konami, the, I, I guess, but, <clears throat> excuse me, Konami should just continue what they're doing because really, 
there's nothing really I would change about what Konami's doing with the Yugi card game. Stop reprinting all the cards because that's disappointing all the long-time players because all the cards are getting devalued. But I guess that does help new players, but the old-school players go bad because of all the new cards getting reprinted and stuff. It really downgrades the value of what you've been saving up. What do you think? Um, I just think the um, maybe the Shonen Jumps, the Yu-Gi-Oh Championship events, need better prize support because it seems like a lot of people would go like because back when they really had uh, good prize cards like Crush Card and Gold Star, a lot of people went to Shonen Jumps, and um, I just feel like that would attract more people. But I fucking love this game, so I'm always gonna uh, you know play it no matter what's going on, and uh, just as long as they uh, do the format right, make the right format changes. Okay. Would you like to see Konami do a uh, a Hall of Fame similar to Magic the Gathering? And if so, who would you like to nominate for a Hall of Fame player-wise? Other than Adam yourself. Korn. Adam Korn. Adam Korn. Yeah, for sure. My good friend Adam Korn. I would like to nominate him as the best Yu-Gi-Oh player around. Definitely goes nominated. Yeah. Yeah. All of you, Adam Korn. Okay. Korn. <laughs> okay um, you can, like, Philly Luna for having four jumps. He has a YouTube account, too. Right. What is? Acorn. What Acorn. is? Yeah. Um... I'm in favor only because Magic's been around for a long time, longer than Yugi. And if Kon and in a way, everybody knows all the good players in tournaments just because Konami posts them up on the websites. And when they do their covers, like, oh, this person won. The, like, when they did the Shonen Jump, they like, oh, the last two duelists were Lightsworn in their mirror match. Mm -hmm. So I'm in favor just because people are like, oh, this guy is the best. We can probably ask him for advice or we can ask him for deck profiles or ask us what to expect in an upcoming tournaments. So yes, I'm in favor. Okay. And you don't have anyone off the top of your head? You're like... like nah, not team. really. Um, yeah, I would definitely be in favor of that. Um, uh, just, I mean, off the top of my head, some quick names I would say, like, probably Adam Korn, uh, Chris Bowling, Jeff Jones, those are players, just to name a few that I respect. What? Valley. You? Oh, um, yeah, I would be for the Hall of Fame thing, too. Have players work to try to get inside the Hall of Fame. And the players I try to nominate is pretty much like Adam Horn, Dale Belito, Chris Foley, Jeff Jones, Cesar Gonzalez, you know, all the people who consistently top eight in YCS. I see.